Holy Pandas are quite possibly the best tactile switch ever made. Even to this day, even with all the new switches coming out daily, they provide a tactility that has stood the test of time. Now the original, if you didn't know, was actually a Franken switch composed of the housing of an Enver Panda and the stem of a Halo True or Clear. Well, no more Franken switch because these have been redesigned from the ground up by the original creators of the Holy Pandas, Quakem's Enver and 21. Not only has the color changed, but there's also a few other changes underneath the hood. So let's take a look. Now the HPXs will be available for $30 for a set of 35 for the pre-order phase and $35 for 35 switches later on, which still comes out to about a dollar a switch. This is way better than the original pricing of the Holy Pandas. Those things are ridiculous at $1.21 switch when you buy a set of 70 but hey we just did it because the holy pandas were the truth they were you know they're kind of worth it because no other switches were providing the tactility and the experience that those were now looking at the switch itself it now has a translucent polycarbonate top and features a nylon bottom like the original the stem is still made out of the same palm material so nothing has changed there it doesn't feel like these are lightly lubed like the original i ran my finger across it and it feels a bit dry this is actually better in my opinion because on the original holy panda Pandas. These were actually over lubed and it was leaking out the side of the box. It just wasn't a good experience. But now these, you can just take these, lube them to your own preference. I think most of us are doing that nowadays and I think they know that. So that's what they're giving us. Now the spring is slightly longer and only has a double coil on either end compared to three coil on the end of the original. The bounce backs on these HPX is quite a bit bouncier. I guess that's the only way I can really describe it. Snappier if you may. The original Holy Pandas also have a longer stem which definitely plays a part in that signature feel and sound when typing. More on that later. Now the legs on the stem are quite similar. When I press them back to back, they still have that nice drawn out deep bump instead of a quick P like a Cherry MX or a Zelio switch. So I'm happy to see that again here. The stem tolerances are very similar to the original with barely any movement and there's barely any top house wobble here as well. On the original Holy Pandas, you couldn't even film these, but on these you can actually film them and make them feel a little bit more solid. Now the return of the bump is actually quicker and higher pitched than the newer Holy Panda X. So it should give us more of a clack during the typing test. First impressions, I still like the deeper sound of the original Holy Panda stock, but let's see if I keep that same energy by the end of the sound test. Now I only got 35 of these, so I only put these on the main alphas that I'm gonna be doing the sound test on so enough talking let's begin i'm going to compare these versus some of the other top tactile switches in my opinion we got everything in here we got the Thox, we got the kiwis we got the durox we got all that good stuff so you guys know the drill right now grab some water some wine some beer if you're underage grab some juice sit back and enjoy these sound tests
Now, like I said, one thing that made that Holy Panda special to me personally was that long pole. You could get that nice round out D. What the heck am I saying right now? I hope nobody watches this out of context. Don't skip the video. Watch it all the way through, guys. All right. Or this is just going to come off completely wrong. Okay. So like I was saying, you get that nice round D bump when you press down, then you get the nice tapping of the long pull on the original, which is so satisfying. And I definitely miss it here. But in place of that, you get that bouncier spring and a shorter pull. It has a very aggressive tactile nature, almost snapping your fingers up after a keystroke. It really reminds me of the NK blueberries, but definitely way smoother than those. There is some leaf ping as well on these compared to the original. And it just goes to show you how good and how special those original pandas were. I will say though that it definitely stands out from the other tactile switches in the video. I tried to kind of compare and see which one it felt like and it didn't feel like anything else that I had. So based off of that it might even be just worth picking up because it's something new and different. Now I personally don't recommend running these stock. I would definitely lube these. It gives them a much richer and deeper sound than the stock. Stock feels super dry and thocky and just not pleasant to type on and these will give you a lot of clack. I put these on my Rama M65B like you saw in the video video and that has a PVD brass plate so I was getting a lot of clack there. So to wrap up I wouldn't say this is better than the Holy Pandas. These new HPXs I think this is an entirely new switch in the Holy Panda line bringing a new flavor to the HP universe for the people that love the original but want a little twist on it. Now the original creator set out to make a switch that was the Holy Panda but with a nice round smooth bottom mount and they've accomplished that 100%. These guys know what they're doing okay. If you like a snappy tactile switch this is it chief i know at the end of the day you guys are going to ask me what's better the glorious is the hpx is or the original i like the original more followed by the hpx and then rounding out with the glorious is all right so that's what i think about these switches definitely worth a cop if you're in the market for some tactile switches linear gang i know you guys are here too if you made it this far these aren't that bad all right you might like them <laughs> all right it has been your boy bt don't forget to like share comment and subscribe and i'll see you in the next one peace